Greetings. You know what? I'm bummed. I'm telling you because this this weather sucks. <laughs> this it's cold now. I mean, we had this great spring where it was really, really warm and you know, verging out hot, and the leaves are out already. I mean, this is only uh, May 11th as I'm making this video, and I mean, you know, usually we don't have leaves until the beginning of June around here, but we got them today. But, you know, because we had such a nice spring, and now it's like, it's cold enough to where you can almost see my breath. Almost. Look at the forget-me-nots over here. They're going to be forgetting. We're going to be forgetting them, for sure. Because they're going to be shriveled up and dead, you know, because it's, it's cold. And my voice is shot. But, you know what I like about this kind of weather? I like the fact that it, uh, it reminds me of the fact the winter's coming again and so boy you know isn't it funny how you take it for granted once this once the nice warm weather comes around you know you're just loving life enjoying it and then all of a sudden zap at least up here in the in the new york we get cold weather comes back and it's like okay okay i'm not gonna take it for granted again when it's warm i'm gonna actually mow <laughs> You. you step in dog poop, cat? But you bummed even more so, you bummed about your life and the fact that you wasted a lot of time. You know, the, the fact that we wasted a lot of time in our youth, or maybe you are young and you've still wasted a lot of time. You know, rather than waste your time worrying about having wasted your time in the past, there's a way to fix it. For one thing, put yourself in a mindset when you think that way to realize, you know, hey, you're right, you know, Lord's coming back. I need to wake up and get going for the Lord and do what's right. But, but what do you want? What do you need to do? You need to wait. <laughs> that doesn't sound right, does it? You got to wait? But I've just wasted all this time. Now I got to wait? That's right. You got to wait on the Lord. Trust also in him, and he shall bring it to pass. Wait on the Lord. Be of good courage, and he shall strengthen thy heart. Wait, I say, on the Lord. It says in Proverbs 3, 5, and 6, Trust in the Lord with all thine heart. Lean not unto thine own understanding. In all thy ways acknowledge him, and he shall direct thy path. Uh, the cat wouldn't, I, I wouldn't let the cat sit on my lap, so now she's over on, the, on my ladder which I'm using as a tripod but now she's making an earthquake over there she's going to be attacking my camera before you know but, yeah wait on the Lord what's it say in Ephesians Ephesians chapter 5 verse 15 it says or 16 redeeming the time because the days are evil you know what redeemed means right you think of redeemed, we think of Christ. In the song, maybe you think, Redeemed, how I love to proclaim it. Redeemed by the blood of the Lamb. Redeemed through His infinite mercy, His child and forever I am. It's a variation on the other redeemed song. Well, I don't know who actually wrote the tune to that one, but Ron Hamilton wrote the, that tune there. Redeemed. Redeemed, bought back. Bought back by the blood of the Lamb. That's what it means, it's bought back. And when it says redeeming the time, we're going to buy back that time. We're going to buy back that time. How are we going to buy it back? By waiting patiently on the Lord. He'll bring it to pass. He'll show you what to do. Don't worry about it. Just relax. Don't try too hard. Let the Lord guide your steps. Be watchful. Be mindful of the things that God's putting in front of you right where you're at. Don't feel like, you know, i got to be a missionary to some far off land. Oh, you need to be a missionary to your neighbor. Just take a few steps. There they are. Let's read the rest of this or the passage here in Ephesians, or leading up to it. Wherefore he saith, Awake thou that sleepest, and arise from the dead, and Christ shall give thee light. Wake up first, but then wait on the Lord, because he's the one that's going to give you the light. See then that you walk circumspectly, not as fools, but as wise. How do you walk circumspectly? By committing your way unto the Lord. 
in all thy ways acknowledge him, and he shall bring it to pass, and he shall direct thy paths. Redeeming the time, buying back the time, because the days are evil. You can buy back that time. Just start right now. Do what's right before the Lord. Wherefore, be ye not unwise, but understanding what the will of the Lord is. And like I say, he'll show you what his will is. Wait on him. All right? Very good. All right, and we'll wait on the weather to turn nice again, and hopefully the forget-me-nots won't will forget us, or won't forget us. Never mind. I'm trying to get tricky here, but... They'll live to see another day. Trust you will too, and if not, hey, we'll all meet in glory one day, all right? All right? All right, where's my cat? Kitty cat! She's way across the yard. Kitty cat! Kitty cat! Here she comes. Here she comes. She's like, I'd say, about, uh, she's about 50 yards away. She's, kept, she's coming here. Wish I could turn the camera around. Wish I had a remote, made that thing go bzzz. Come on, Kitty cat, hurry up! She says, you don't want nothing to do with me. Come on, Kitty cat, hurry up. We don't want another 10 minute video. People won't watch. Come on, Kitty cat, hurry up. Here she comes, da 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 Now she's coming. Here she comes, here she comes. Come on. <whistles> Gotta act like you don't care with cats and then they'll come to you. Come on, come on. I don't care. There she is. You know, cats require patience. They, they don't trust you if you don't let them lead. You know, you can't, you can't walk a cat. You have to have patience. We'll make a video about cats and dogs coming up here very soon. But in the meantime, thanks for watching. I'm getting out of this seat before it breaks here. That's another thing I gotta do. Redeeming the time. I gotta fix that little bench there. Look at there. This is like my kid's bench there. There's Winnie the Pooh, eh? Thanks for watching.